Hey guys, my name is Tom, and this is some domination on Discovery. Um, I had I had a sub ask me. Uh, it's worth to, to say a sub, a subscriber. He asked me, or he told me that he uh, he missed my old commentaries, and I kind of I've been slacking on doing them. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. I got into doing let's plays and and walkthroughs, and it it made me think last night. I was at a I was at a friend's uh, birthday party, and I I got the email and I replied to him. And the group that I was sitting with, we were kind of even at that time sitting around talking about goals and and what we were working on and, and things uh, that we wanted to have happen with those projects and kind of even where those projects started. And it's weird how, uh, I, don't, I don't know if this is true for you guys, but when you start something and you're working on whatever it is that, that you're into at the time... To watch how it evolves from the re, the, you know, the original reason that you started it. Um, and I'm sorry, I'm gonna kind of be uh, all over the place on this one because I just wanted to to get on and to record and and uh, just get what came out raw because I miss that kind of uh, that kind of atmosphere, <laughs> I guess, with my commentaries of being able to just throw it out there and and yabbity yabbity just uh, just uh, sling out what I'm thinking. And uh, I think I've gotten away from <clears throat> what I originally wanted to do. Uh, you know, I, I tried to think of even why I started watching other people's videos. And it's originally because I, I wanted to get better at the games that I was playing. And uh, you know, the whole reason that I usually even start uh, projects, like the reason that I started the band, and uh, the reason I even started doing videos on YouTube... Where, one, the main reason, I thought it looked fun. Uh, every, you know, everyone that seemed to be making these videos, this is the same way that I had friends that were in bands, uh, they seemed to have a, a really good time doing it. And I wanted to be a part of it. Uh, and, and that's just it, is I, I myself, I like to be uh, a producer in fields that I get so much enjoyment from. I don't know, it's, it's really neat to think about that somebody... You know, I want you to think about really how much enjoyment you get from, uh, you know, your favorite things, whether it's a record or these videos on YouTube or video games or books. But whatever it is, how much enjoyment you get from from these media outlets, and how cool it is that somebody that you don't know made a product that you enjoy so much. And I found myself a couple years back really wanting to give back to things that I felt I had taken so much from. I don't know if I've actually ever said that on this channel. That was the original reason why, uh, hell, why I started the band and, uh, and why uh, I started doing this channel. I, my priorities tend to shift on, on both, uh, you know, on whether or not I'm working on the music thing or the video game thing. The video game thing eats up so much time, and it's, it's been really hard to juggle developing my relationship with Melinda and and developing my hobbies at the same time. I'm, I, I struggled for a while with being able to uh, incorporate time for, for everything. And, and I still, you know, I still struggle with it. There are times where I guarantee I'm pissing her off because I'm I'm playing so many video games or having uh, a late night practice. And I eat, that is something that I'm trying to work on is I really don't know how uh, people find the time to do it all. And it's, you know, it's just one of those things that I have to realize is a part of, I, you know, quote unquote, growing up, which I, you know, I struggle with daily. I, there are several times where I feel that being a grown up sucks. And I find myself wanting to keep digressing back to old habits and, and uh, old schedules, and there's Melinda right now. Normally I wouldn't even record these things in front of her, but that is just showing how I'm trying to get comfortable <laughs> in these new <laughs> habits and routines because, uh, you know, she's going to be my future wife, and uh, having her not hiding, I guess, this from her, you know, of feeling like, I used to feel like I needed to shoo her out of the room and be like, oh, I got to record this thing, even though she was going to open up her iPad later or her phone later and watch it and hear it. But, um, I, you know, I'm, I'm getting away from my major point. You know, uh, so I, I struggled with, with scheduling and, and uh, even hell, you know, I, I got my job and, and getting up early and 
making sure that I was prioritizing these real life things before these, uh, you know, different projects that I had going on. Because it's hard. When something's fun, you want to say fuck it to everything else that's not fun and just spend all your time doing the fun thing. But, you know, you spend too much time doing one thing and it it slowly gets, you know, uh, a little routine and, and boring. And I don't know. You find yourself making these, uh, these uh, I don't know, small mistakes with them. It's, uh, what was it? I don't know if you guys have ever seen How I Met Your Mother, but they call it the yips, where you overthink something that at one point was very simple for you to do. And I, I lately, yeah, hell, I've been finding myself getting the yips and, uh, I don't know, worrying about whether or not I'm, I'm going to make a, a good videos. I think, like, for a good month and a half, I was always just, like, questioning my choice of uploads instead of just, I don't know. I, I still struggle with that, of being able to say fuck it and, and, and do what I want. Um, you know, but these I do miss. It is a way for me to regularly communicate with you. So when he did, uh, when the Rolk left that comment, it, it made sense to me of like, well, shit, you know, I haven't been just uh, sitting down, uh, you know, at least like once a week and talking with you guys, especially because for some of you that aren't subscribed for Let's Plays or what, what am I currently doing? Resident Evil 5 and and Bioshock 2, uh, you know, <clears throat> I, that means I'm uploading a lot of shit that you guys aren't, you know, necessarily interested in, but you're wanting to hear this. Yeah, I, for a while, I even thought about going the tips route and offering you guys w limited tips I could give you on the game, uh, you know, because that that really hasn't been my thing, you know. it's It was always, I think originally, like, I started off wanting to get better myself and post my gameplay to find other people that had similar questions that I did. Uh, and, and then it slowly morphed into social commentary. And, and uh, I'll always kind of lean towards that because that uh, is what interests me. Although I think I'm repeating myself from a previous video. But, I, you know, I do like to talk about, you know, uh, how things I figured out in the game and help you guys out if you do have those questions. My, you know, my major tip for a game is always going to be, especially for a game like Call of Duty with competitive multiplayer, is uh, don't let somebody tell you how to play the game. Really, fucking don't let anybody tell you how to do anything. If you respect their opinion and you want their advice, you know, take it. But if, uh, if it's some rando uh, out there trying to tell you how to run your shit and run your life, uh, don't listen to them unless you really think it's sound advice. You know, make sure the criticism that you take to heart is constructive criticism. The criticism. But that was all over the place. I stumbled and fucked up some words, but that's how I like it sometimes. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm, uh, I'm going to hop off here and clean my room and shiz because I'm trying to organize everything in my life at this point. But I will talk to you guys next time. I hope you're having a great week, and I will definitely be getting to you guys soon.